We talked about the fact that, you know, if I help you, because I know you've, you've talked shit about me. You've said, you know, Dad, Bobby don't help nobody. You've said this. I'm not saying you're saying it right now. No, no. I, I mean, the bottom you've line said is, it. it's, it's been said by me before. Exactly. But the bottom line is, what I realize is that you don't owe me a motherfucking thing. You don't owe me nothing. You know, and I, I, I had to come to the realization of that, you know. I gave you your talent, but my talent was given to me yeah. by my father, which is given to you by your father, sure. which is given to you, and which you're going to give your son, hundred percent, Bobby. Yeah. Okay. So it's going down the line. It is, but I just want to say one thing. I want to say that um, when you when you when we when we spoke earlier, and that I know you've said things like, "My son don't help me. My son don't help anybody." Da 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 respectfully in a place I know that was said from ignorance because there's also a big side of you that you know now but you didn't know at the time you know I have helped people in my family and I've helped people outside of my family I've helped people afford homes I've helped the homeless I've helped people in my black community I've donated anonymously oh I know, you know? I know all those things that you've done but let me finish so what I'm saying is is uh Respectfully, Dad, you actually don't know all the things that I've done because most people don't know all the things that I've done because I don't exploit the fact that I give, let alone to my black community. Mm -hmm. I'm not out here trying to prove my blackness. Mm -hmm. You know, I'm not a nigga who goes to the hood with a fucking turkey every Thanksgiving <laughs> and throws it out. I'm not. That's not yeah, who I am. Yeah, so with that yeah, being yeah. said, Daddy, when we spoke earlier today, I know there's a lot of motherfuckers even in our family. Who could be like, oh, Bobby, don't, you know, he got all this money, he got millions of dollars, but he don't want to help nobody. He don't want to buy nobody a house. Well, hold up. Let's just step back real quick. And I'm going to say all this and this. It's not going to be a one, one sided conversation, Dad. I promise you. But this, uh, I just want to get this out and I want to say it and I really want to go back and forth and I want to have fun. I want to laugh and I want to have a good time. But I just want to say this because it's very important to me. There was a time when you came to me, asked me for $850,000 to buy you a house studio for you and your band. Now, I've also had my sister ask me to buy her a house. I've had my brothers ask me to give them money. I've given tens of thousands of dollars to my brothers and my sisters, and I've seen them piss it away. So when you do the math, right, and we did the math earlier today, exactly. it's you, it's my mama, it's my brother, it's my sister, it's my other sister, it's my other sister, it's my other sister, it's my other brother, it's my other brother. That's nine. Now, let's not talk about how many fucking kids all these people got, but let's just talk about those nine people. Yeah. So if I'm going to buy y'all a decent house, that's $500,000. That's for two people, one million, two million, three million, four and a half million dollars just to purchase that, let alone mortgage, let alone other bills that come into that. Mm -hmm. Now, okay, you got a house. So then what? That's nine houses. Let's not, let's talk about nine vehicles. Let's talk about nine cars that I got to pay for. Let's talk about nine gas bills a month I got to get paid for. Let's talk about nine AT&T fucking bills I got to pay for nine Comcast bills HB, HBO bills <laughs> not no I'm, I'm, I'm gonna keep going because guess what if I'm if I'm paying all this money ain't nobody on welfare no more niggas ain't fucking broke no more so they ain't on welfare they ain't on food stamps that's nine people I got to pay for food for that's nine people I got to pay for vacations for now let's also talk about the fact that a majority of your children and my mother's children all have children so let's duplicate that motherfucker times about <laughs> however much that is fuck that fuck that shit and unfortunately I've learned when I give 10,000 here 5,000 here of cash to somebody and then they blow it and then they don't got nothing they don't use it right and then they look at me like I fucked up or I did something wrong and then they come back and they ask me again and again and again now as a as a fucking millionaire who has broken that cycle made it out the hood educated myself and understand what it means to be self-sufficient mm -hmm. there is no way as a fucking man that I could ever as much as it hurts me to see the people that I love struggle give them money and watch them just burn it to nothing again. So I say all that to say, Daddy, I love you with all my heart. And the only reason I ain't never given you a crazy amount of money is because I didn't want to see you blow it. Now, with all that said, we had a conversation today. I'm going to buy you a truck and I'm going to do more than that. 